Well, hello everyone, Dr. Jeff Galini here and welcome to another episode of Ask the Scientist. This show is about busting myths and bringing you the truth. Hey, Kyle uh, wrote in and said, this was a question uh, that showed up on EFX Sports um, Facebook and uh, Mark asked, is there any scientific evidence that creatinine Creatine is more effective than regular creatine monohydrate. Kyle, thanks for submitting that. Mark, thanks for uh, that comment. Um, folks, we love you know positive comments or good questions on any of our social media platforms, whether it be Dr. Jeff, All American Subs, EFX Sports, you name it. Is there any scientific evidence? Yes, there is. Um, if you go to allamericanpharmaceutical.com, Um, All of my patented materials are there, all of my research. I have tons of published research on crealcalin versus creatine monohydrate, peer-reviewed, published, great stuff. Yes, we outperformed with no side effects. And that's the whole claim to fame with crealcalin is I said from day one, no loading, no bloating, and no side effects. And because of that, you could take a smaller dose, 1.5 grams. Now, 22 years later, obviously people are copying, saying, oh, we have no side effects. Oh, we mix better. Oh, you don't have to load. Oh, you don't bloat. Not true, not true, not true. Stole it from the source. Anyhow, Mark, go check it out. All the studies are there. Um, If you have not tried crealcalin, you will want to follow allamericansups.com because right now I've been told they're actually giving away free bottles. Try it for yourself. I've always said that if you're going to buy something, you should be able to take it for a test drive. And this is EFX Sports Crealcalin, the purple caps, the one and only. So go over there, follow them, get on their mailing list, and uh, check it out yourself. All right. Thanks, Kyle. Thanks, Mark. God bless.